It's strange. You spend your whole life looking for something. And then suddenly, you found it. And you're holding on to it. You're holding it. And do you know what you're thinking? This is the happiest I'm ever going to be. Right now? This moment. It's all downhill from here. <laughs> That's depressing. It's incredible. Kiss me. You know most people come here to look at the water. I spent some time looking at it. Now I'm listening. You're gonna climb in next? Only if you dare me. Light from these stars took thousands of years to reach us. They're just a memory. But that doesn't make them any less brilliant. Before you were born, I was scared. Scared of how and when I was going to have to tell you. But you've grown up now and You're so strong, and brave. I don't have to be scared for you anymore. This is a gift. There's so much time in front of you. Time for you to appreciate everything you'll see. And you're going to see so much. You know, you're supposed to take a girl to your favorite restaurant on the first date, not the seventh? Eighth. I had to make sure you deserved it first. <laughs> well, this food better be life-changing then, because I'm pretty amazing. And yet it wasn't clear that I deserved it until the eighth date. Seventh. And don't get your hopes up. The food is terrible. It's almost inedible. But you can't beat the view. Can you describe it to me? What? This. Tell me what you see. Uh. Well, it's an open roof, I guess. And it's just black, the, the sky, I mean. You look up and you just see this blackness reaching into forever. But then there are these lights. They're strung across, reaching the, over on the walls, too. These twinkling lights illuminating everything, the tables, the plants, you and me. 
It's completely... Underwhelming. <laughs> F. Um. L. O. The darkness is starting to sort of maybe get an F. closer to the center. Z. You can't go so long without seeing me. D. I know. Well, I'm sure you know what's getting. You're always looking at things. Isn't everyone? It's different. It's like. You're seeing something no one else can. There's something I need to tell you. Something I was gonna tell you anyway, tonight before we got too serious. You were gonna say before we have sex. Well, it has been over a month. That's all my virtue means to you. <laughs> You are so beautiful. Don't sound so sad when you say it. It's okay. Busy. Every street has a million different things to see. I know that's what I wanted, it's just... Sometimes, it's lonely. Choroideremia? It's a genetic disease. It means one day I won't be able to see. When? There's not a specific date I can count down to, just I was born with it and little by little it gets worse. Like, here, at night, it's difficult, but I can still manage. A year ago, it was kind of normal, but eventually... What does it look like? Like a circle on each eye. I can see better in the center, better outside of it, but where the line of the circle is, it just keeps expanding. All I can do is wait. But I... I try and look at it as time I have that a lot of other people don't get. Time where I can see things and store memories. Like stars. The way their light shines on even after they've gone dark themselves. Anyway, you have a right to know before we... Before we have sex. I understand if you don't. Now, if you say it's all downhill from here again, I will choke you. I meant it positively. Close your eyes. Tell me what you see.
I see you.